Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, who were they? Matthew who? Mark who? Luke who? And John who? What were their last names? When did they write? Did they know Jesus Christ? Did they walk with Jesus Christ? Did they eat with Jesus Christ? Did they talk with Jesus Christ? Did they even meet Jesus Christ? The answer is no, 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 no. Conclusively. The earliest of them that wrote, wrote 40 years after Jesus Christ, so they never met him. The last of them wrote 80 years after Jesus Christ, never met him. The other thing is, all of them seem to have written the gospel according to, according to, according to, according to. Now, when you write a letter, do you sign it according to? Where in the world is a document with only one name of four different writers that did not meet the one whom they're writing about? Where is that accepted in the whole world? Nowhere except in the Bible. Because a writer would not write his only, his first name according to. And there's a great amount of suspicion that the man called Paul, Saul of Tarsus, that because he wrote all the books from Acts all the way to the end of the New Testament, how many books is that? How many? 16, 15, 17, 19? All the books of Acts on Colossians, Ephesians, Corinthians, Romans, Galatians, all of those books are written by whom? Paul, Saul of Tarsus, another man who never walked, who never talked, who never met, who never ate, who never prayed, who never knew Jesus Christ. Isn't that something? Now here we find four writers and another one between them that wrote all the New Testament books that never talked, never walked, never ate, never prayed, never met the man called Jesus Christ. And Paul, by the way, before he had that vision on the road to Damascus that only he saw and only he heard, guess what his occupation was? Do you know? He was a bounty hunter, a hunter of Christians, hunting them down like animals, binding them and bringing them to where? To Rome so that they could be executed. Now if Hitler, after killing thousands of Jews, said that on the road to Berlin, he had a vision that he was named an apostle to the Jews, and he wrote 20 books that all the Jews are supposed to follow, do you think they would be following that book? <laughs>